What's up guys? Today we're going to play We're Not Really Strangers with a stranger! Hello! Hi stranger! I'm Jeremy Zucker. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to jump right into the game. Do you want to go first? Read me the card and, okay. and just tell me whatever you think. What okay. fast food restaurant do you think I'm most likely to drive through? What's my order? Okay. What kind of fast food guy are you? Okay, so were you mainly in the East Coast or West Coast? Um, I've spent time on both, so... I don't even know if they have a drive through but Five Guys? Um, not really Five no? Guys. No. <laughs> no. I don't think they have a drive through so... Okay. It doesn't count. Try another. McDonald's? Donald's. Really? It's, it's kind of classic, yeah. Okay, but why? Well, I think actually I'm a Wendy's guy, but I don't know if that's even people really even know about that out here. We used to have Wendy's in Singapore, mm -hmm. and Open. they just had so much bad luck. The Wendy's flooded. Oh. It wasn't because of the flooding that, that they left, but yeah, yeah. Wendy's didn't yeah. enjoy Singapore though. <laughs> I just feel like in America, Wendy's kind of is the best quality. Like McDonald's is really consistent. But, yes, classic. You know, like that stuff, who knows where it's coming from, you know? <laughs> in America, but like- He said it. Out of the country, out of America, it's like McDonald's is good quality just because the US has kind of shitty ingredients. Are you into spicy food? Oh, love spicy food. Wendy's has the spicy chicken nuggets and McDonald's doesn't. Well, in Singapore, we have the McSpicy. Ooh. Go and try it. McSpicy. Mm -hmm. Is it a sandwich? Chicken it is. sandwich? It is. Cool. Go and try it. Right up my alley. Alright. Ooh! This is fun. Okay, I got it. It says here, what does my Instagram tell you about me? They say whatever comes to your mind, okay? Oh god. Don't hold okay, anything I'm back. Really on blast for this. I'm a little bit nervous about this one. Call me Chao or Chao? Chao. Call me Chao unless you're my you're my mom. What <laughs> are you looking at? Ooh. Okay. Top three are like food blogging things. I, I mean, I do like food. Food. I'm not a food blogger, mm -hmm. but I do talk about food quite a bit. Because we live in Singapore, there's just so much food to try. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Um, I mean, I'm also basing this off of meeting you right now, but you seem like an extrovert, like a very outgoing, friendly person. All of your pictures are very front and center, and you're like, I'm comfortable being the center of attention. That is me. There you go. Alright, thank you. <laughs> Should I judge your Instagram now? <laughs> you can, if you no, want. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna. Do you think I was popular in school? Let me narrow it down for you. Okay. High school. High school? Yeah. Every era, I had like different... It, different levels. social circumstances. I'm gonna say that you were a popular kid. You do music, music's cool, it brings people together, mm -hmm. and you write a bunch of stuff that lets people feel things. So I reckon that kind of lets you connect with people yeah, well. It's almost. Like, almost? my high school was quite mainstream. Okay. So like doing music was kind of alternative. I wasn't picked on, which I like felt very lucky. Um, but I definitely wasn't popular or like in the popular group. I had like friends everywhere, but like no one that I was really close to. I did not have a friend group. And like I felt like really weird about that. Okay. So I was just kind of on the border of like all these different friend groups and I just didn't really know where my place was. Mm -hmm. But in middle school, um, I guess you guys call it secondary school, like 11, 11 to, to like 14 and 12 to 14. Yeah, that's like secondary school. I was super popular in middle school. No big deal. <laughs> okay. I, I didn't have a lot of like friend groups to go to either, so I was always kind of moving around groups. Yeah. And it never felt like I had a, a home, like a base Same. people to always send to. Mm -hmm. Yeah. School life, man. Yeah. Okay, it's like a little bit similar to the previous card, but do I look kind? Explain. You do look kind. You have very kind eyes. Ah, kind eyes. And a very nice smile. Thank you. <laughs> Connection. Has a stranger ever changed your life? Okay, I have a story related to school. When I was in junior college, now this is around high school, 17, 18, uh, I wasn't going through like the best time. I had very little friends, nobody to really turn to. And there was one day I was heading home after school. It was pouring rain. So I'm not sure if you've seen the monsoon rains here yet, but it pours. Mm -hmm. And I was waiting for my bus. But when the bus came, it was just a pool of people I couldn't even board. I was gonna just walk back home in the rain. But this teacher saw me and she just called out to me because she saw that I missed the bus and she was also going to take the same bus. She flagged the cab down and she said, just come with me. She had no idea who I was. And back then, I used to be very uh, reserved and just like, kept to myself a lot. But in the cab ride back home, she was talking to me and she let me feel like I could open up to somebody. And I feel like that moment was just a really big deal to me. Even though it probably just went by her without her even knowing what she'd done. But I felt like somebody was listening to me for the first time in like months. That's great. Yeah. That's so sweet. And it was like high school, so... Yeah, it meant a lot. Yeah. What's been your happiest memory in the past year? This memory in the past year? Mm. Oh man. A year is such a long time. 
something to stand out. I know, something should stand out, right? <laughs> <laughs> I really had a lot of fun during my last tour, in London specifically. Ooh. I just got to meet so many nice people and like met up with some old friends and met their friends in London and then some of them visited uh, New York when I was there and just like getting to, to bring all of my friends together to like all hang out together and everyone sort of meeting each other but they're all people that I love. From different um, parts of your life? Yeah, from different parts of my life. It's kind of like point. assembling the Avengers or something. <laughs> exactly, yeah. But Avengers of your life. Mm -hmm. So stuff like that makes me really happy and I put a lot of trust and respect into people that I love and the people that they love mm -hmm. and even if I don't know that person like I feel like we already have some like serious common grounds. Right. When the worlds collide it's really special. People that are important to you in your life. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. I'm gonna read you this. It's a bonus card. Okay. Okay. So you know what it is. I <laughs> I might. <laughs> Press shuffle on your music library and explain the first song that comes up. I like this. There you go. It Which can be playlist are you gonna choose? Oh, I don't make playlists. Okay. It's just all the songs I've ever saved, so it's gonna be weird. Ready? Shuffle it, shuffle it. Oh, the band Camino. Okay, what does this mean to you? It's from like a couple years ago. It's like a really feelsy, like lamey adjacent song. I'm a final Yeah. Like a really good, like, Feels the electronic. Mm. I don't really listen to this kind of music anymore, but it still hits me. So I do have one final, final question mm -hmm. just before we wrap up. If you could add any song to a playlist, what song would it be? All right, so I have a playlist right here. Mm -hmm. And what I want you to do is to add a song, any song that comes to your mind. Oh, I don't get to see what's on here already? Mm -hmm. No, because it's a compilation of songs that strangers added songs. Oh, that's really yeah, cool. It's just a bunch of songs that strangers put together. Okay. And you're one of the like, strangers. <laughs> I love that. Ooh, I already know. It ain't over till it's over, Lenny Kravitz. You know what? I don't so think many I need to stop crying. <laughs> it ain't over till it's over. You know what? I'm gonna have to listen to that that's one. That's a great one. Thank you for the song. Of course. Right. And that wraps up our little game of We're Not Really Strange. Do you feel less of a stranger? Yeah, I feel like we're too. Less, yeah. stra less than strangers. Less than strangers. Thank you, Jeremy. Less strangers. Than yeah. Cool. Strange. <laughs> All right, bye. <laughs>